Pluto is miles off and a diffused, extra-accepting planet that was once a cycle of our nearby planetary system. However, advancing terrifying statements by principal astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have brought Pluto back into the spotlight. They suggested that this far-off world is on a potential collision course with Neptune. But how could this really happen? Furthermore, what could be the consequences of such a massive event? Are we witnessing a troubling cosmic eccentric occurrence, or is there more to this seemingly perpetual disaster? Join us as we examine the plausible outcomes of a Pluto-Neptune impact. Pluto, a former planet that was reclassified as a dwarf planet, remains a subject of interest in the exploration of the universe. As highlighted by ongoing hypotheses from leading experts, Pluto's orbit is perilously close to Neptune's. Astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku are both raising alarms about a potentially dangerous collision between these two planets, a scenario that could have significant implications for Earth. But how is such an event even possible? Pluto's journey around the Sun is unlike that of any other planet in our solar system. It takes a remarkable 248 years to complete a single orbit. Since its discovery in 1930, it has not yet finished one full revolution. Yet the story doesn't end there. Pluto's orbit is marked by its unusually elongated shape, deviating significantly from the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. What makes Pluto's orbit even more extraordinary is its inclination, which is tilted at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane. Pluto's orbital path is highly unpredictable compared to the other planets. This inclination and eccentricity add layers of complexity to its orbital dynamics. One of the most intriguing aspects of Pluto's orbit is its interaction with Neptune. For nearly 20 years in each orbit, Pluto comes closer to the Sun than Neptune, contrary to what we would expect from their positions within the solar system. This prompts the common question, why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational influences of other planets. The analysis of Pluto's orbit began shortly after its discovery. Initially, Astronomers sought to understand its unique trajectory. Unlike the other planets, whose orbits lie relatively close to the ecliptic plane, Pluto's orbit stands out with its steep inclination and irregular shape. The mystery deepened with the realization that Pluto's orbit does indeed cross Neptune's. The stability of Pluto's orbit, despite these peculiarities, is evidence of the intricacies of celestial mechanics. The three-body problem in space involves understanding how three objects, such as Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, interact gravitationally. It's like predicting where these objects will move based on their initial positions and mutual gravitational pull. In Pluto's case, this problem illustrates how its orbit, Neptune's orbit, and the Sun's gravity collectively work in a complex but harmonious way. Key terms such as non-synchronous libration, orbital precession, and VZK wobbling are crucial to this puzzle. Non-synchronous libration, in Pluto and Neptune's case, means that when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is at least 90 degrees away from Neptune. This spatial separation is critical to maintaining their orbits and preventing collisions. Orbital precession refers to the gradual vertical movement of a body in its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it comes closest to Neptune or other massive planets, it is situated far above their orbital plane, adding another layer of protection from potential collisions. Another key concept is VZK wobbling, named after three scientists, Vladimir Zurovlev, Kai Vashishta, and Konstantinov, who studied gravitational interactions. This wobbling involves the gravitational tug between three space objects, e.g., Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, and helps explain why Pluto's orbit near the Sun is so irregular. Despite this irregularity, the wobbling ensures long-term orbital stability. The VZK wobbling demonstrates that, although space phenomena may seem chaotic, patterns and rules impose some order. These forces help keep Pluto's orbit stable, ensuring it does not collide with Neptune or deviate dangerously. Numerical simulations conducted in the 1980s revealed that, despite Pluto's stabilizing properties, its orbit is inherently chaotic. Minor deviations in initial conditions can lead to dramatic variations over thousands of years. However, these characteristics have been shown to maintain stability over immense time scales. Further analyses show that the giant planets, Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn, play critical roles in stabilizing Pluto's orbit around the Sun Neptune and Pluto share a unique relationship. For every two orbits Pluto completes around the Sun, Neptune completes three. Jupiter's massive gravity also helps ensure Pluto's orbit remains consistent, potentially for billions of years. 
This intricate interplay of forces highlights how the solar system is finely balanced. Without these stabilizing factors, celestial bodies like Pluto might collide with others or be ejected from their orbits, triggering a chain reaction. The case of Pluto illustrates that even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve harmony through the intricate interactions of gravitational forces. It also underscores the importance of ongoing observation and analysis to deepen our understanding of the universe. Prominent astrophysicists like Neil deGrasse Tyson have voiced concerns about the potential for a collision between Pluto and Neptune despite the stabilizing mechanisms at work. Tyson, a key figure in the debate over Pluto's reclassification as a dwarf planet, has provided unique insights into the complexities of orbital mechanics and the public's fascination with space exploration. Tyson has emphasized that Pluto's reclassification was not meant to diminish its significance, but rather to reflect a more accurate understanding of the celestial objects in our solar system. His contributions extend beyond mere classification, delving into the evolving dynamics of space and the forces that govern planetary systems. Meanwhile, Michio Kaku, another leading astrophysicist, has approached the topic of a potential Pluto-Neptune collision with a mix of caution and curiosity. Kaku highlights that while the gravitational mechanics currently prevent such a catastrophic event, any disruption, such as a rogue planet or significant gravitational perturbation, could destabilize the delicate balance between Pluto and Neptune. This leads to a broader discussion of the chaotic nature of orbital systems. The butterfly effect in celestial mechanics suggests that even minute changes in one part of the system can cascade into significant consequences elsewhere. For instance, an external object passing through the outer edges of our solar system could disrupt Pluto's orbit, potentially putting it on a collision course with Neptune. Potential Consequences of a Pluto-Neptune Collision If such a collision were to occur, the consequences would be far-reaching. The impact would release an enormous amount of energy, potentially ejecting debris into the outer solar system. Some of this debris could enter the inner solar system, posing risks to Earth and other planets. The collision could also destabilize the orbits of nearby celestial bodies, including Kuiper Belt objects and even some moons of the giant planets. The long-term effects might include shifts in the gravitational equilibrium of the solar system, altering planetary orbits and potentially disrupting the overall stability of the system. While this scenario remains highly unlikely given the current understanding of Pluto's orbit, it underscores the importance of continuous monitoring and advanced simulations. These tools help researchers predict potential anomalies and refine our knowledge of the intricate gravitational interplay that keeps the solar system in balance. Broader Implications for Space Exploration The study of Pluto and its orbit has broader implications for understanding the dynamics of other planetary systems. It provides a valuable case study for exploring how gravitational forces shape the behavior of celestial bodies over billions of years. Moreover, examining Pluto's unique characteristics, its highly eccentric orbit, interaction with Neptune, and classification as a dwarf planet, highlights the diversity of objects in the solar system. This diversity reflects the complexity and richness of the universe, reminding us of how much remains to be discovered. A call for continued exploration. As we advance our understanding of celestial mechanics, the need for continued observation and exploration becomes increasingly clear. Missions like New Horizons, which provided unprecedented insights into Pluto's surface and atmosphere, demonstrate the value of sending probes to distant worlds. These missions not only expand our knowledge of the outer solar system, but also inspire a new generation of scientists and engineers. Pluto's story is far from over. Whether viewed as a dwarf planet or a remnant of the Kuiper Belt, it continues to capture the imagination of scientists and the public alike. Its orbit, interactions with Neptune, and the broader implications of its dynamics offer a window into the intricate workings of the cosmos. As Tyson, Kaku, and other leading experts explore the mysteries of Pluto and its place in the solar system, one thing is certain. The study of this distant world will continue to reveal surprising insights about our universe and our place within it, understanding Pluto in the context of cosmic events. Pluto's peculiar characteristics serve as a microcosm of the unpredictable and dynamic nature of the universe. Its orbit, heavily influenced by gravitational interactions with Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn, showcases the intricate dance of celestial bodies over vast timescales. But Pluto's story is also a reminder of the fragility of cosmic harmony. Cosmic events, such as rogue planets, nearby supernovae, or perturbations from interstellar objects, could upset the delicate gravitational balance that keeps the solar system stable. Such scenarios, while speculative, are not beyond the realm of possibility. For instance, 
the detection of interstellar objects like Oumuamua has sparked discussions about how external bodies could influence the orbits of planets, moons, and smaller objects like Pluto. If a significant perturbation were to occur, Pluto's current gravitational safeguards might not be enough to prevent a catastrophic event. This underscores the importance of monitoring the outer reaches of the solar system and beyond for potential threats. The Role of Technology in Predicting Cosmic Events Advances in technology, particularly in computational modeling and space observation, have revolutionized our ability to predict and analyze cosmic events. High-powered simulations allow scientists to test countless scenarios involving Pluto, Neptune, and other celestial bodies, offering insights into potential future collisions or orbital disruptions. Space telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, and upcoming projects like the European Space Agency's Plato mission contribute significantly to our understanding of distant planets and their interactions. By studying Pluto and its orbit in detail, researchers can refine models of gravitational interactions, enhancing our ability to predict and mitigate cosmic risks. Pluto as a symbol of scientific progress. Pluto's journey from being classified as the ninth planet to its reclassification as a dwarf planet reflects the evolving nature of science. Its study has pushed the boundaries of what we know about the solar system and has led to new questions about the definition of planets, the behavior of celestial bodies, and the structure of the universe. This reclassification has sparked debates among scientists and the public, underscoring the importance of clear definitions and communication in science. Despite the controversy, Pluto's unique status has brought attention to the Kuiper Belt and the wealth of knowledge it holds about the formation and evolution of the solar system. Looking ahead, the future of Pluto exploration. The exploration of Pluto is far from complete. Missions like New Horizons have provided only a glimpse into its surface, atmosphere, and interaction with its moons, such as Charon. Future missions could focus on mapping Pluto's subsurface, studying its geological history, and understanding the composition of its icy surface. Moreover, advances in propulsion technology could make it possible to send more sophisticated spacecraft to study Pluto and the Kuiper Belt in detail. Such missions would not only deepen our understanding of this enigmatic dwarf planet, but also offer insights into the early history of the solar system. Final Thoughts Pluto's Legacy Pluto's story is one of complexity, resilience, and discovery. Its orbit, interactions with Neptune, and unique characteristics challenge our understanding of celestial mechanics and the structure of the universe. As scientists like Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku continue to study this distant world, Pluto remains a symbol of the boundless curiosity and ingenuity that drive humanity's exploration of the cosmos. While a collision between Pluto and Neptune remains highly unlikely, the study of their gravitational interplay offers valuable lessons about the delicate balance that governs our solar system. Pluto reminds us that even the smallest and most distant objects can have profound implications for our understanding of the universe. As we continue to explore, observe, and learn, Pluto's legacy will endure.